Uh, today, I'm gonna go help Ben Holler from the Holler Homestead process his meat birds. Uh, but first, gotta get my coffee. All right, I got myself my latte. Let's go process some birds. I'm here at the Holler Homestead. Ben and Meg are getting the final preparations all set. Ben's tending the fire, getting the water temperature up. And right now the kids are getting some ice in the coolers. Oh, you tilted the other way. All right, we got ourselves the kill station, the scalding station. It's not quite scalding yet. Ben's been working on this for since six this morning. Since six this morning. <laughs> uh, had a real nice fire and then I was filling it up and it overflowed and uh, put out the fire and I've had a hard time like catching back up. Yeah. The plucking station, the evisceration station, and then in the cooler. So it is time for us to go wrangle some chickens. Ben's gonna grab his farm truck. We're gonna load the back of the bed with the chickens yeah. and then time to get started. Now I don't think they're gonna jump out. I think they'll stay in the back of that truck. Yeah. but. Let's see how this goes. You guys have done this a few times. So what uh, process improvements have you made this time and what will you do next time? Uh, well, in the very near future, we are going to get some more reliable way of heating the water. Uh, that's been the biggest hang up, hang up yeah. pretty much any time we've done chickens and pigs for that matter. Uh, I think this time we're actually a little bit undermanned uh, usually we have four people because um, Meg's kind of tied up with the baby because the baby refuses to be put down yeah. uh, that's kind of what the hang up is but yeah. all in all for having you know three people we're doing pretty good yeah what time is it about 12 30. so we've been doing it about an hour and 15 and we're almost done with the first half of the birds so I'd say we're doing pretty good. Yeah. good. And you guys are keeping the, the legs, the livers, and now the hearts. Yes. Yep. And what do you use the, the different parts for? Um, the feet will be for stock. The livers, we usually make pate. Um, I can also add them into like chili and stuff. And then the hearts, you have told me that they are great fried. They are <laughs> fried, breaded, and fried. So yes. we will try that. <laughs> That'll be good. Gotta get these guys cooled down. Yes, sir. That was 100 pounds of ice. Usually that does it. Yeah. I'll just say we'll get another 10. That way we're drowning in ice. Yeah. How about we go, come back, piece them, out. piece them out, empty these out, make room, put more ice in, because we're going to be out of ice by the time we do the next batch. Ah. Ah. do that? I think we're uh, we're gonna be all right now. Good. Are we gonna have enough room for uh, I think 20 we're more gonna, chickens? We're gonna process, like break them down and okay. get them into pieces. Get them into pieces, okay. and then we won't have to worry about it. Okay. Right after our wreck, I was really hurting. Oh yeah. I had whiplash. Oh yeah. And we went up there to the roads and 
I helped him do some chores and he's like, you want to do the polar plunge? Sure. <laughs> it's just nice path because it's July. And so we filled that tub full of ice. Got in there, I lasted what, 45 seconds? Yeah, it's a while. It is so hard to breathe. It is. <laughs> he's did like, you, just did you keep your arms under? Yeah, you that's, go, that's the hard part, you go arms. right up to here. Yep. And he's like, just control your breathing, go as long as you can. And it's everything you can do to take a breath. Yep. And then, like, it, me and uh, me and Jason did it. And I'm looking at him, and he's looking at me, he's like, <laughs> are you done? It's like, I'm done. And we both got out. I tell you what, my neck quit hurting. My, uh, I felt so good, and I, I was hurting so bad. I didn't even want to be there. It was just like I just want to go home. I want to go to bed. Like I hurt so bad. And after that, I felt great. Life was good. Yeah. So, I'm a fan of the ice bath. Yeah, me too. I have absolutely no interest in nope. taking that ice bath. None whatsoever? <laughs> nope. It wakes you right up. <laughs> nope, I'm good. Coffee does that too. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and the only problem with uh, all these feathers is uh, if you leave them in there, they get really dry and it's hard to get them out. And these are really packed in there right now. I am starting to pack up stuff because we are running out of room in our coolers. So we're going to do the first half and get our hearts and our livers and our feet packed up and out of the way. And then um, we'll weigh them. Then we'll start on the chickens and we'll start piecing them out. I like to barbecue stuff and having a pack of leg quarters is like a game changer. And up to this point, like all we do is whole chickens. And sometimes you don't want to have a whole chicken. So what we're going to do today, we're going to break them down into pieces. We're gonna have breasts individually packaged. We're going to have wings. Uh, we're gonna do leg quarters. And that way, if I want to barbecue or, you know, Meg likes to do like roast. Something other than roast so chicken. Something <laughs> other than roast chicken every now and then. So doing it, taking the extra time to, uh, you know, process a little bit further. Uh, it's kind of, a, kind of a big deal. So we're gonna do that right now. This is the intermission. Yeah. Uh, we went and got more ice because uh, we were kind of low on ice. Apparently 100 pounds of ice wasn't enough. Uh, so that's what we're going to be doing is breaking down chickens. So uh, I'm going to set this down and we're going to get busy. taking a lot longer than we all anticipated. So it's about what, 3.30? Yeah, it's like 3.30, I don't yeah. have my phone on me. Yeah, so we have an hour and a half left of daylight okay. and 20 plus more chickens to process. So it's a mad rush to get it, to get it done, but we feel like we're gonna do it. Okay, we're on round two, last batch of chickens. had a very successful day. I think we processed something around 50 chickens. Uh, it did take us a little bit longer than we expected. The last step of bagging the chickens we're actually not going to do tonight. So Ben and Meg are just going to keep them in the ice bath uh, over overnight and they'll bag them in the morning. They have a couple of roosters that they're going to process tomorrow as well. Other than that it was successful. I want to say thanks to Meg and Ben for having me out. I really enjoyed it, enjoyed the company, enjoyed the conversation. Are we all done? We're all 
all done. Let's eat. All right, what's for dinner? It doesn't matter. I'm gonna eat it. <laughs> Carnitas and rice. Very uh, Californian of us. Yeah, awesome.